So we made a few changes to this S3 nose gear by adding the steering servo directly into the the uh, gear actuator mechanism. Let me just go ahead. And now we can steer it with the uh, steering servo. And it gives us about 60 degrees on either side of center line. Yeah, go ahead and turn that if you would. Well, I'm trying to put it back to. Here you go. It's really fighting that spring. Yeah, I know. The uh, go ahead and flex that. That's gonna. That's gonna. The strut has a spring mechanism inside to duplicate the effect of a of an oleo, and the spring that's, is actually. It's real heavy right now. We're probably pulling it's twenty quite pounds right tight. there. Tight. I built this thing so that it was easy to get to the workings of it by simply pulling this screw out to a 440 cap screw loosen that one and then this whole mechanism just rotates up and out of the way and then this is the little drive link that uh, that links the servo with the steering mechanism in the so right now the it needs just a little bit of adjustment which I'm going to make here and then we'll uh, then we'll try it over again. Okay, so what we did is we pulled the, the wheels and tires off of it a little bit here to make it easier to demonstrate because the the aircraft is designed so that the wheels are in the air when they're in this position and and this strut wouldn't be compressed which is kind of tough to compress it until the airplane actually touched on the ground so in this position it will it steers just fine it comes around about that far and it retracts like that And steers. Butimus. There's a couple of small items that need to be modified. Uh, one of them is the the shape of this channel in here that directs that pin as the thing as the gear um, extends, so that if this steering is off just a little bit when we go to retract. It can't bind up in here. Right now it would. But we'll put a little V-shaped channel on the very top of it that helps direct that pin to center itself before it gets all the way down. Other than that, I'd say that, uh, that it's in pretty good shape the way it is.